You always just some opening in dressing room. What was the atmosphere like in there after that win over Samoa? Good, yeah. Obviously, it was good to get back to winning ways. Um, a lot of good things in that performance, a lot of positive things. A lot of things we can work on as well. So um, it was just good to, to get the win, um, score a few good tries out there and get a bit of momentum going into next week. What was the key to breaking them down in the end, do you think? We just needed to get field position. Uh, we needed to, to put a pressure on them that way. They, they were playing from their own half quite a lot. It was, it was raining, it was wet, it was difficult to play. So we put pressure on them that way. You know, we were going to get some good counter-attacks, some, um, some good set piece in their half, and I thought that's what we did, especially second half. How did you feel your own performance went on your first start? Yeah, it was all right, yeah. I mean, um, obviously there was... There's always things you can work on. You're never, you're never going to put in a perfect performance. But as a team, I think it's the same as well. There was things out there which are very good as things that we can get better with. So it's a great environment here. That's the sort of thing that, that happens. You, you come in and you get better. So um, we'll be looking to do that this week. A few big hits in there as well. <laughs> yeah, I think you've always got to expect a few against some more, aren't you? Um, they're a very physical team, fair play to them. They brought that tonight. So um, you just got to get up, shrug them off because um, it's part of the game. And <laughs> I just managed to cop a few tonight. How did you feel the combination with Owen went today? Brilliant, yeah, I was saying then there was um, two of the tries at least came from his communication so, um, and his execution, especially the first one on that, on that first phase play and the, the crossfield kick was all, all Owen's communication, um, just leaving it you know, for me to kick it really. So to have that second pair of eyes and that, I suppose, another ten outside you to who understands the game was, was brilliant for me. What do you take forward to the Wallaby game next weekend now? Well, I mean, there's a win, so we've got a bit of momentum going. There was a lot of good things. I think the forward pack again, the line-out was brilliant. Um, uh, the backs, obviously... Um, it's got to try for the first phase, which is a massive plus, and we're just we're just in a good frame of mind now. We're just going to come in this first couple of days this week, try and get better and attack Australia next week because uh, we know it's going to be a tough one. You mentioned know, Samoa linked arms at the end of the game. Can you just explain to me what was happening there? Yeah, no, it's the thing. Uh, it's more it's more to a prayer there at the end of the game to to basically um, thank us for, for playing the game and wish us well for the future. We did the same back, so um, it's a brilliant moment to to be in them sort of um, things after the game because it doesn't happen very often and um, they're a very passionate bunch and uh, it's brilliant to be out there with them. Does it mean more after a hugely physical game like that? Oh, it does, yeah. Well, like I said, it, it, that's what's brilliant about rugby. You smash the, smash the hell out of each other during the game and then you come together after and you shake hands and, and smile. So, um, you know, fair play to this morning. They were, they were very physical tonight. Cheers, George. Thanks Cheers, a lot. Well played tonight. Thank you.